Hey guys, I am the voice behind the Get That Coin on TikTok. I'll link that in the description. But I'm just going to show you what goes on behind the 60 seconds when it comes to loading the coins in. Basically, it's true. I really do go around the house and get the coins. I found these in the laundry room. It's another. I use this gift card box, present box, to put the coins in because it's easy to carry around and just put the money in. I'm, I'm going to use gloves and maybe at the end I'll wash them. Like, see how much dirt and grime is really in there. I do have hand sanitizer on me at all times. It's foamy hand sanitizer. Because my hands are literally something close to black after I load all these coins in. So, just a way to keep sanitary, keep me not from not getting sick. Really the most boring part, but also fun part, is loading the pennies. And the reason it's the most fun is because how small they are and how easy they just glide in. So it's pretty easy just to snap those in. We are 846 and we are definitely getting to $20 by the end of this video. Basically, I like to um, encourage people because what is the point of this account besides documenting my journey? I want it to help other people in their journey too. Now, I know people don't come from a lot of wealth, but even if you don't come from wealth, even if you don't have that much money, you can still collect money. Even if it's not in as big portions as I may collect it in. I'm trying to make a kind of a movement really on TikTok is my platform that I'm trying to do. And it's because, honestly, I collect it and it's so fun. It's days and days worth of collecting money that I work for this. And I'm willing to work for this because I know the outcome and I really want those skates. Um, in case you haven't seen my TikTok yet and you're just finding this on YouTube, I'm trying to get the Impala holographic roller skates from Zoomies. And they're the cutest thing ever. Ever, ever. And I'm a really big skater, skateboarder. So... We don't have a lot of money to just splurge on some roller skates. It's a pair of roller skates. It's really just a lot. But it would be really big for me to get them. And that if you support me in that journey, then you're supporting me in other people's journeys too. Saying that they can do it. And just really overall just helping everybody out. Really. That's what I want to do. Because I could save money and I could just wait a while and save it and just wait a while and save it. Or I could really be committed and do it. And that's what I decided to do. I'm spending my Saturday. I spent my Friday collecting money. And I spent my Saturday. This is Saturday. I've spent hours upon hours right now. The videos you're seeing have been saved in my drafts and worked on and worked on. So, what you're seeing is kind of a finished product of a lot of work that I put into this. And that is why I sound so serious in some of my videos about these topics. Like, it is possible. That's what I mean. It's because I put in all this time. I put in all this effort. And it's working. Because once I get to $100 in this coin bank... I'm going to cash in for money, and I'm going to get those skates, and I'm going to keep collecting, even if I don't have a goal. Because guess what? When you do have a goal, this will be a big part of that goal. And I think that is so important. I really do. It's in my heart. It's in my blood. I really have to, considering I've already preached. I preach this message so much. I feel like at a hundred dollars, considering we are at like around twenty right now, hundred probably be like fifty is probably like right here. Hundred probably will be at the top. So we're gonna keep working. We definitely are gonna keep working, and we are definitely gonna get to our goal. And I 
have other things to pay for too. I have data to pay for fifty dollars a month. So it's stressful. It really is because I, I feel like what I'm collecting for, I just have to give it away. But that's not true because I know it's not true because I'm collecting right now and I'm spending time. And my dad saw me lifting up clothes in the laundry room, going to the bottom of the washer, and, like looking in jars and. He saw me dumping out purses, and he saw that, and he said, you know what, Addy? I'm going to pay for your data this month, and I want you to take that money that you save up that you're working for, and I want you to buy those skates, and I want you to keep up that account that I see, because he monitors everything I do, because he said, I truly believe that you will get there based on the work I've seen you do and the money I've seen you collect, and that literally almost brought me to tears, because... I am going to. I am going to buy those skates and I'm going to skate the heck out of them. And I am going to keep saving money because I saw the effects of collecting money. And I saw what it's done for me so far. And that is really my inspiration behind the TikTok account. And it's such a small account, it's probably not going to get anywhere. The three videos I posted on it collecting and counting this money got zero views and zero likes and i'm following two people my brother and then i count that also has the same goal as me that i knew wasn't that big and he liked some of my videos and i liked his videos because he has the same basic message and i feel like i need to support people that are supporting the same cause because overall if i believe in this cause and somebody else is also believing in this cause they deserve their respect and they deserve the attention that I would want in supporting that cause and that is my TikTok account uh it's in the description and basically go check it out go like it up you know my story some of it and you know and it's kind of what's happening beyond I'm just sitting here I've been watching Mr. Beast videos he just made a like a team announcement video on YouTube that's like two minutes long that I've been watching. I've been watching Sidemen. It's I don't want to get controversial because people don't like them. People might not like them, and I don't want to share my personal preference on YouTube. But yeah, um, like it up, follow it up, because you know that this is gonna be a long journey and a very right journey for me to go down.